Hey, right, Charles, AGP here to give you the top seven reasons why I think that Modern Warfare 2019 is going to be the best Call of Duty we've gotten since 2011 when we got Black Ops. The first reason is that I think Modern Warfare 2019 is summing up to be like the child of Modern Warfare and Modern Warfare 2, unlike MW3, which was more like the other bowling girl to Modern Warfare 2. Anyways, um, the second reason is that obviously we have obvious reasons like the graphics is on a more powerful system than than the games before it um black ops 4 wasn't that great so you know that's 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 why we're not considering that um then on top of that obviously it's gonna sound it's gonna sound much better it's gonna be crazy with the new engine that they have that i talked about in previous videos it sounds as though they're really gonna get um everything down as far as how, how realistic are uh, they're gonna get as close to the realism as to what the gun sounds like between you know cocking the gun and shooting the gun and reloading the third reason is there's a new story you know and the new story looks like it's gonna be dope now if anybody remembers the first two the first stories in the first set of modern warfare the story was really good you know what i mean it was it was it was lit it was immersive um, and you, people fell in love with the characters, um, you know, and I feel like the reimagining of this is going to be even crazier. I mean, you play as rebels and you got to play as kids at one point whose town is getting destroyed by terrorists and you got to sneak out and stuff like that. So that, that, that's, that's, that's going to be lit. I think it's going to be a great new storyline. That next, obviously there's going to be a whole lot of new guns, but the thing is, what's great about this is that they're bringing back a lot of the fan favorites. You know, um, they're bringing back the M4A1, they're bringing back the MP5, they're bringing back the MP7, I think they're bringing back the Mini Uzi, the P90 is rumored, the ACR is rumored, you know, the ACR, everybody loved the ACR. The, um, the Dragunov is, is rumored, um, the EBR is going to be back, the Desert Eagle is going to be back. The 44 Magnum is going to be back. You know, there's a lot of guns that are coming back that we really love. So that's another reason why I think it's going to be able to boost this above all the other Call of Duty. Another reason is Spec Ops. You feel me? Spec Ops is going to be back. And that's lit because Spec Ops, if y'all don't remember Spec Ops and MW2, for those of you who haven't played it, it was a, it was a really good multiplayer mode that you could do locally or online. And it was it was fun. You you and a friend would just go through a bunch of missions. Like they have a lot of challenges. You'd have to fight a whole swarm of juggernauts, or you'd have to, or you'd have to get through a map um, silently um, with snipers and a silenced pistol, like a silent sniper and a silenced pistol. Um, so that's coming back, and we've been wanting more of the local play to come back because when when they took that out, that was that was ridiculous and made it all online, not lit. Now for those of y'all who love battle royale. That's probably coming back. So, you know, that's going to be great because for those of y'all who really love Battle Royale, you'll get it again. I mean, I'm not a Battle Royale. It's not for me, you know, but I like to see everybody happy and they get as close as possible by, by adding all the aspects that everybody loves. Um, so if they can do that, that'll be great. Those of you who love Battle Royale, you're in luck. You feel me? Another reason is the perks. You feel me? Now, the perks um, the perks are coming back, too. You got a lot of the stuff that everybody's used to. And if they put uh, Commando back, which I didn't see on the list in my last video, if y'all want to check that out. I didn't see Commando on the list. But if they do, y'all know what that means. If they put Tactical Knives back, hopefully they put Knifing back. We don't know if they're putting Knifing back. But I think they are. So if they're putting Knifing back then this will definitely be lit because that was one of the things that made MW2 so great. But I don't know if they have Commando and they put back the fact that you can knife from a distance, we're going to have a lot of people doing craziness for uh, this one. People used to, to basically knife you from across the map. It was ridiculous. What happened there? I've never seen anything like that. It's ridiculous. It's obvious what's being done out here. It's on a nightly basis. I hope the world can see now what's really going on out here because it's getting ridiculous. It's really ridiculous. But did it come out of your mouth accidentally? Is that yes. what happened? Yes. Mouth accidentally? Is yes. that what happened? Yes, man. It's, this is ridiculous, man. Ridiculous. Demarcus. Now, next up is maps because you already know maps make 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 a great Call of Duty if you get good maps. Um, obviously, they're already doing a good job with this this two v two gunfight because they have at least a certain amount of maps that you can only do gunfight on. But think about it, you know we're gonna get probably a whole lot of DLC for this game because if they have all the things that they're talking about having in it, this game might be around for a while. They might just keep adding through DLC, but. Think about this. We might, you know, we're gonna get Nuketown and Firing Range back. We could possibly get High Rise back. You know, we want that. So 
Y'all already know. We get those. It's going to be on and popping. The last thing is that, you know, nukes are coming back. I hate nukes, but, um, yeah, a lot of people used to use them, and it was like. The last thing I'm going to leave y'all with is the, the last teaser they gave us. They've been giving us teasers every other day, and I think another one just came out today, but I'm going to catch y'all later. You know what I mean? I appreciate y'all watching this, and I hope to see y'all soon. Love y'all. Peace out. Also, I know I said seven earlier. Um, I'm at eight things. Okay. Peace.